We have a new program at Phillips High School and it's called Behind the Pause. Um, Behind the Pause is a student information uh, program. We discussed on many occasions, you know, how do we get the word out about the program and one of the things that the students did discuss heavily is that, you know, Twitter is, is such a big thing. It's even bigger in some cases with teens more than Facebook. The students are responsible for updating the page. It's a part of them being a, um, a responsible member of the Behind the Pause crew. Everybody's eyes up front. You had an interaction. Click on the A is for connect up there. And a lady from downtown that works in the Department of Libraries 22 hours ago actually responded to one of your tweets. I'm also going to educate my students about proper etiquette when they are online. So she's complimenting you. How would you like to respond to this tweet in a positive manner? You should say like, um, thank you for, thanks for your recognition. The four of you together, I'm gonna take a step back. I want you to come up with a really nice reply that you can give to this nice comment that was placed on the Twitter page. But before you hit reply, I wanna take a look at it first, okay? Okay, you got nine more characters more now. You got nine right. more characters to go. And stay tuned. Now, do we agree? Yes. Okay, now you can click tweet now. <laughs> All right, that's what I'm talking about. We're actually using Twitter the proper way it should be used instead of when we're at home saying things like, oh, finna eat me a Big Mac. Or, oh, right. I got this hard to do. But instead, when we're here, we say things like, we appreciate the fact that you're watching our media, uh, our media video, our broadcasting video at Phillips High School and we're spreading the word around to people so that they can see how good a, a school in Phillips really is. These are the skills that are needed that if, if some of them want to work, whether it be in television production or maybe they're working in a social media department for a Fortune 500 company, you know, or maybe working for a school district, you know, these, they're, they're being trained. They already have this great experience, you know, to start off. Who knows, someone could see this and see me on him be like, oh, she really know how to speak. She got a cute smile. We could use her on TV actually one day. In the long run, you have uh, future employers and sometimes the colleges that are looking at these pages. So it is important that we inform and we teach our kids how important it is that they should behave properly while they're online.